I called him before. I told you I fell out to uh, Rich Cooper. But last time I called, you wouldn't let me speak. My already kept yelling over me, but I'm off that. But um, so I've been watching y'all chat, and I noticed, I just think that, like, as black men, like, y'all should treat black women, like, with a little bit more respect. Because, like, honestly, let me let me ask you this, Fresh. <laughs> Yo, Fresh. I'm here, brother. <laughs> All right, if I let's say we're in the club, right? Mm-hmm. And you walk up to a white woman and she looks you in the face and says, No, thank you. I've never been with a black man before. No, thank you. How would you feel? Okay, move on. Yep, be <laughs> like, Okay, move on, right? Mm-hmm. Now, how would you feel if she say, I don't dabble in the dark? Like, look you, <laughs> looks you in the face Bro, and say, I don't dabble in the dark. There's so I, many girls how would you feel? in Miami or wherever I'm at, I wouldn't care. I'd be like, Okay, understandable. <laughs> Listen, no, what I'm it's saying, a numbers game. Somebody said something racist like that to you. To oh, you face. mean the emotional feeling of feel. the comment, right? Is that what you mean? Yeah, like the, the comment yeah, yeah. to your face. Like straight so to your face. I don't dabble it'll be, in the dark. It'll be disrespectful, of course, but I'm not going to get mad at it. It is what it is. Cool. All right, well, shorty's racist. All no, right. That's what I'm saying. So wouldn't you think, okay, I understand, like, y'all get on the women because they'd be like, oh, who hurt you? Like, how you say things, sometimes that does matter. Wouldn't you say that that woman is coming from, like, a place to, like, hate? All right, um, number one, my friend, you're trying to conflate a girl rejecting you out of club with an obviously racist remark to the same as making a joke on a podcast. Hold on, hold on. No, they're not the same whatsoever. Us making a joke, reacting to a super chat that was sent in, by the way, okay? Remember, they asked us, are you on the dating app Black? And we said, ha, no, no, we don't dabble in the dark. And not, not, not night writers. That's not the same as being at a nightclub and telling someone right to their face, hey, I'm rejecting you because of the color of your skin. They're not the same at all, dude. Yeah. Whatsoever. You're trying to conflate two different, completely, like two completely different scenarios. I mean, you can make it seem like it was a joke, but you were, like, really being honest. You ever heard J. Cole say all good jokes contain true shit? Like, bro, you really don't like black women, bro. Like, the way you <laughs> convey yourself, the way you talk about them, let's be what? real. Um, no, and we I don't like tell, ratchet I, women. I tell, like, you've been <clears throat> Something happened in your life, like, a black woman definitely hurt you. And I hate to say that because I watch the show all the time that laugh that do hurt you thing. But it's really, man, you really come from a place of, like, somebody definitely did hurt you, bro, like a black woman. Yo, you you know what? It's and interesting. Think, you literally sound like a woman right now speaking. <laughs> like, bro, this is a female <laughs> argument that you're making. Look, number no. one, okay? A preference is a preference, number one, okay? Number two, I've dated black girls. Y'all have seen some of them that have been on the show, okay? I dislike ratchet women, regardless of their skin color. Facts. Okay? So my thing is I don't like non-classy females that are ratchet and hood. I don't like that shit, regardless of their skin color. I don't care if they're white, Asian, whatever it is. If they talk like, period, all this other shit, I'm like, nah, man, this is a headache. That's number one. Number two, when that happened originally, right, someone sent in a super chat and we were reacting to it and making jokes, etc. okay, if you're going to take it that way and be like, oh, you just hate black women, blah, 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 that's fine, bro. But it's a joke at the end of the day, and it's not the same as the scenario that you tried to put on Fresh earlier saying, oh, yeah, well, what if a white girl at a club told you that she don't dabble in the dark, it's not the same as us making a joke on a podcast, bro. Okay? Yo, That's ridiculous. You keep, hiding, you keep hiding behind this joke thing, bro. Like, you, you clearly say it's your preferences. I watched the thing you did with Andrew Schultz. You were stating your preference. You it's our preference, say, and it's a joke as well, because we're saying we're not on black. Ha, ha, ha. We don't dabble in the dark. But you've seen me with black girls, so clearly it's a joke. What are you talking about? If you see, if I say I don't dabble in the I dark, and then you've seen me with black girls before, <laughs> well, which one is it? Who's seen you with a black girl? Bro, there's photos online with Myron the Black Girl. I've never seen he posted on his page shoot before. Are you see, bro, I, I was dude, I, I was on the yacht with, with Black Girl. Like, like, <laughs> bro, like, what do you say, bro? No, well, listen, I I don't know, bro. I, that, that's the problem. See, you don't see, know. See, that's see, the problem. A, you see. don't know. See, this is the thing, dude. You're over here making know. assumptions. You listen. don't know. You don't know. Every time Dollface comes in here, people make jokes, right? Because I used to see her. She Jamaica. She black. Yeah. Okay? Shout out to her, by the way. Shout out to her. Good cool. girl, by the way. She's cool. You know, super f- chill. Yeah. But the point I'm trying to make is, yeah, right, man. you know, she has an enormous amount of respect for me, and I respect her, too, because she's she's a good person. But my thing is, she black. Nobody says anything about that. <laughs> you, know what I'm saying? you know what I'm saying? It's like, bro, no, no one here is racist. Like, you're just over here saying this stupid-ass shit. It's not true. You can't sit there and say... Oh, Yo, well, it's, you it's made a joke out of these black women and you don't date black women, but then you see me with one and now you want to be silent and not say nothing. 
I've never seen you with a black woman. That's the problem. Like, you don't know. So you're, talk, you're talking off you something need, you don't know. You need to go back to our previous okay. videos, bro. Just because you can you be with a... That's, how, that's the argument that people make. Oh, I got a black friend, okay? Like, you had sex with a black girl? What does that mean? The way bro. what I see is how you disrespect people. You it's again, it's too serious, bro. As a black man, you should treat people, you should treat your black woman more respect. Like, do you not see us white roast white and Asian up. girls on here too? We roast all races. Why, why, why is the black community so that like sensitive about that? I don't see you. We, we just made a dog joke on his chick. I didn't hear you say nothing about that, about her cooking dogs. We make jokes. We make jokes on Russian girls. She's cool. We make jokes on Ukrainian girls. We make jokes on all girls that come on here. How many times have I pulled the Russian hat out when a Ukrainian's here? Like, come on, bro. Have you? I've never really seen though. I don't really see Indian men get up on a platform and disrespect Indian women. I don't see no other race really do this. We thing. have. They say they thank you. Indian come again. I said, are you serious? All the time, bro. No, we saying, literally I'm just made had an Indian girl here the other bro, day. We I, said, I said that. No, word for finish, word. Yo. Word for bar, bro. I think that black people. I think that. Yo. Color, like you are ill informed, bro. And bash our own people. I'm saying I'll ever see because fair people do that. I don't see. I don't see any people do that. I just think we think it's okay for some reason to disrespect black women. It's not yo, okay. yo, 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 you said you watched the show. Have you not That's seen? My opinion. Have you not seen us roast all the other races? Bro, you lost, bro. Come right. on, man. I, like I said, it doesn't make it okay. <laughs> what? Bro, why are you watching Fresh and Fit then? Man, go watch something else, man. Shit oh, like bro, that offends you. Why are you, why are you watching us? All, I watch all y'all shows, bro. It's just hard for no, you me don't. to sit here. No, you don't. Like, I see if you watch all the shows, you would see that we roast everybody. everybody. You would see the jokes. You would see the hats here I actually on the panel. I watch every, I watch so then what, what's show. the issue? I, I call Shorty Ling Ling. Like, nigga, what's the Are you tripping on? How do you not see all these hats, bro? Hey, hold on, hold on. Asian. Hey, hold on. We got Mexican. And we are. We got Native American. You hey, not that one. Not that one. Not that one. No, no, no. Yes. Not that one. We got uh freaking Egyptian pharaoh type shit. Like, bro. Yo, the Marco, bro. We got Saudi Arabia, Dubai. We got Jamaica, Jamaica. We got Russia in here, bro. Come on, man. Like, bro. Remember I caught last time? Remember I caught last time and I told you you were scared to debate Dr. Umar? Bro. He's scared of us, bro. bro he you won't got a come. Viking hat? Yeah, 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 you got everything, bro. A Viking hat? Dude, the point is, bro, I get it. You're emotional about us, a black woman. But trust me, my mom's black, my sister's black. We did black girls as, as well. It's fine. It was a joke. You know, we make funny jokes sometimes. If you're taking it personal, bro, I don't want to tell you. Bro, honestly. what do you, what do you, look at all these hats on the f table. I, we're, we're covering almost all seven continents. What the f are you talking about, bro, that we're racist to every, to, to just black people? What are you talking about, bro? I pulled out these hats on different occasions, on different people, racist, tell your different back. nationalities your, and different backgrounds. Tell your savior, Dr. Umar, to pull up. And here, yeah, do, Dr. Umar don't want to do it. He don't Fresh do it. already talked to him. Yeah, he oh, don't want to do it. You don't want to debate Tariq Nassib because you can't yell. He's an L. Because he's, he's a nobody, bro. He's, a, he's, he's, he's an L. A, I said, I, I said specifically. No, no, no. I said specifically. He's not a it, nobody. He is a nobody, bro. I said specifically. I said specifically. If to, yeah, that dynamite, yeah. Boom. Yeah. I said specifically, right? I make the Arab jokes too on my own people. Come on, man. Yeah, I don't <laughs> nine uh, ten. You know? Nine anyway, twelve. Arabic, yo. Mom Arabian, why do you think that's okay? Like Why do I think what's okay? Isn't your mom like a Arabian or something? Why are you doing this? <laughs> yeah, my family's from why Sudan and I'm and I'm totally okay with making fun of my culture and my people, because I'm not a why is that? Why are you so okay with that? Like, why you get on a platform like this? Why you got demonetized? What's your issue, bro? Why is this so funny to you? Wow. Because I'm not soft. Just being an I have thick skin. Words don't hurt me, bro. Of uh, people making racial jokes, I think racial jokes are funny. Of all races, all, that it's it's though, what makes us unique and also makes us like interesting and makes it funny. So that's what it what? is, bro. This you're is you're literally one very one soft. Doing it is different when you do on a platform like this. <laughs> Bruh, what the hell? Yo, what, 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 yo, did you just did you just come over from H three or some shit? Like, yo, you sound like a man. We, let's like, move. holy shit. Let's move on, bro. Man. Did like, why are you so soft? We need some real hair. Why are you hair. so f sensitive? What year were you born? Two thousand one. I just think that you're perpetuating a certain type of. Never mind. All right, just move on, bro. No, here's the other thing too. Here's the other thing too. I want to I want to let you know. Um, as far as like, cause you mentioned Tariq Nashi, whatever. I said specifically, mm -hmm. if he's gonna come on, he's got to bring Doctor Umar with him. If he's gonna come on, no, Doctor Umar don't want to talk to you. Don't okay, to then, to then who's this? Who's scared then? <laughs> who's scared then? Then who's scared then?
Because you first made the that, argument that, that we're scared said, of Dr. Tariq Umar. Tariq Nassi will definitely debate you. Tariq, Tariq Bro, Nassi will definitely he, destroy see, you. Bro, see, Omar. you got to understand that there's levels to this shit. If he's going to come on and get that kind of exposure, we need something in return. He's got to bring Dr. Umar so it makes sense. Otherwise... It don't make sense. He's irrelevant, bro. And two, two's better than one. He's irrelevant. Let's keep it a thousand. He's irrelevant. His YouTube channel has been I, stuck I, in the same I, number forever. Who cares kind of what he's got to say? You're setting up this awesome man. You know Tariq Nassi will come up there. He's going to destroy you by himself. Omar don't want to talk to you. He don't think you have no real clout. He thinks that you hate women. He don't want to talk to you. Because he's scared. He's really they, so, yeah, because he's scared. Because he's scared. He's not scared. He just don't think you're worth it. This is how you don't think Tariq Nassi. Yeah, we're yeah. bigger than the Dr. Omar. What are you talking about? Yeah. What the f but you're not. He's not even on YouTube. You know, the only people that know Dr. Call Umar are idiots like you that are running around and call themselves FBAs. Bro, nobody knows these man. Call her. Like, they're not as famous as you think. Bro, nobody really knows you like that. You're going into my show. <laughs> Shut the f*** up. I, no, what I'm are you talking about? You a clown. You just said you watch our shit. Get the f*** out of here. <laughs> you sound like a f***ing clown. Let's call her, man. Holy <laughs> man. You her L, bro. Let's call her. Yo, you're a whole f***ing L. You're over here defending these. Bro, do you not understand outside the black community, nobody knows who the f*** these f are? If they leave the United States, no one knows who the f*** they are? The R when we're, yo, look, look, let me are. explain something to you. We could go international, people know who we are. When we're in Romania, people know who we were. When we're in London, people know who we were. Oh, no one knows these f outside of the United States because they cry oh, about I'm, American problems. Umar, they cry about slavery and Jim Crow laws and the black American and we're foundationally black. No one knows these outside the United States, period, bro. We're international. People watch us in different people languages. People know who the f*** we are because we actually give real value instead of crying about racism all day. That's all these dudes do is race baiters. They cry about racism all day, how the black man's being held down in the United States. That's why people only know them in America, all right? We're that's, inter that's unfair, national. Bro. That's so unfair to say. You know, there, people can, you know, the same thing you just said about that, right? People can sit up here and say that y'all cry about women all day. You know, sit up here and red pill, masturbate. There's a lot of things people can say about show, but it's not really true. That's not but but here's the work. difference. Here's the difference. Work. What we're talking about is felt internationally, bro. Yo, <laughs> once you leave the United States, no one yeah, gives a fuck about the African American experience in America and how we're that's oppressed, bro. That's, that's, that's all we talk about. That. That's not true. Who cares? Bro, yeah, that's not true, bro. Dr. Umar has his passport. He travels across the he goes to Africa, he goes to many different places. That's he great, goes, bro. But at that's the end of the day, wrong. that's great. That's great. But no one cares. Like, I'm trying to explain to you that the international community doesn't care about the African American struggle in uh, in America. They don't care. It's not a topic that the rest of the international world is concerned with. So their audience isn't going to be as big. It's a very nuanced audience of a minority of people that true. feel that they were wronged, okay, by the white man in America. That's who watches these Bro, that's the reality. So I looked at it like this. Yo, it's a big come up for both of them. So if they want to come on, both of them got to come on. Not just Tariq. It don't make sense. It don't make sense. There's black oppression. There's black oppression in other places that Dr. Umar touches on. You're just wrong all all around. But whatever. Bro, but their arguments are yeah. mostly American centric, bro. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. Yeah. Okay. True. But it's still other issues that other black, black people deal with in other countries. Fantastic. That about. But that, but that, but his his main stances are almost always American centric. They call themselves foundationally black Americans. It's in their title. No, no, he calls himself a Pan Africanist. But okay, okay, Tariq calls himself an the FBA. African they have different acronyms okay. for being whatever. <laughs> Tariq Nasheed, they're not going to debate him. Bro, I told you already. If he could bring Dr. Umar. Then it'll make sense for us to do it. But otherwise, you know we don't get no happening. benefit. Not, otherwise, we don't get no like benefit. You sound, like, you sound like H3, bro. <laughs> You're not trying to compromise, at least. Like, come on, make something happen. If you really want to talk about this, he's going to wipe the floor with you, bro. I'm telling you, you're not really ready for this conversation. The RP stuff you've got, I'll give you that. Nobody can beat you on that. All right, man. Whatever, right, I'm bro. I'm going to let y'all go. Uh, all right. You just embarrassed yourself on air. See, and these are the people that got the most to say. No, bro, you're, you're, because I'm telling you that you're very soft. You're over here like crying about really minuscule. I don't know why you watch us. Listen, honestly, bro, this is like the I'm shocked that you actually watch us. A single mother. You said why? Why I are you making racial you jokes? Because I have single mother, bro. Because you have what? My people, it's not soft. You are soft. No, I have respect for myself and my people. I would never get up on the platform and disrespect black women the way you do. It's just a difference. I was raised differently than you. Did you not I, see I'm all these soft. hats here? I can take Did you not see all these hats here? What? Did you not see all these hats here that I just I showed? I'm telling you about my people, though. It's, it's not about a joke. I don't care what you say about a joke, bro. You got to represent your people better than this. It's not about being a joke and whatever you're saying.
I'm not soft. I can take a joke, whatever. No, you can't. Clearly yeah, not. You call in because you pressed about it. You have a platform. People watch you, bro. People are influenced by the things you say. You think when they see us disrespect ourselves, other people think it's okay to do that, bro. That's all I'm saying. It's not a joke no more. It's really this is real life, bro. They call it. They call it. Get up here. Every black girl, they'd be like, "Oh, she's a tranny. Oh, it's a, it's a man." Like y'all just weird. The chat's weird, bro. They get it from you. So you're gonna blame? Okay. The chat got it from me. Yes, they are in heavily influenced by everything you said. Bro, you're 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 soft, bro. You're really f- soft. No, I'm, oh, I'm just, the fact that you are this myself. pressed about f- and, um us making racial jokes is telling about the type of man that you are. Because you represent an idea, bro. You, you are literally soft, bro. That's what I'm and, right, and this man. is what I'm trying to say. You like this, no this is the thing. We fight back against culture like you. This fucking soft cancel culture sensitive being politically correct can't talk shit about blah 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 like can't make jokes like bro you are the problem people like you are literally the problem people like you report videos like you are literally I've the issue I've never reported I don't even know why you watch us bro we're too, a little too hardcore for you I don't know why you watch us why don't you go watch Hassan Abi or H3 not. or something well go watch politically correct people that you know walk on eggshells when they make jokes and shit I don't know why you're watching us real talk this podcast isn't for everybody bro Huh? I don't know what else to tell you, bro. Like, the fact as an Arab man with Arab parents, you can sit up here and disrespect yourself like this. You're in your own people. I just think it's weird, bro. But that's that's my opinion. Whatever, bro. I'm soft, I guess. You are soft. Then the whole chat's saying it, too. You'll, ever, you'll never see a Hispanic person get up there and disrespect. Like, you've never seen a Mexican person get up here and disrespect this culture like that every day and think it's a joke. Like, bro, no, bro. People every really Hispanic comic gets on are. stage and makes Mexican and Hispanic Comedians jokes. Comedians make jokes about their own culture, bro. All the time, bro. <laughs> bro what are you talking about? What are you, yo, you're a f- man. God damn, you're bro. Not, you not, are f- made. You're not even a comedian, though. You're not a comedian. Bro, it's oh, in, entertainment. Do, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Do I, do I have to be a mathematician to, to do math, too? <laughs> Do I have to be a mathematician to say one plus one is two? <laughs> That's the logic you're using. You're not a comedian, so you can't make jokes. <laughs> what? No, but you're keep I'm not a chef. I can't cook food. Bro, you got to be a comedian no, to make a joke. A Can we move on, bro? This is a ro- not a I'm losing brain cells, bro. Yo, What's you are honestly sound like a female, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You are super pressed about single mo- jokes, man. Single mother made. This, this is yeah. What year were you born, bro? Ninety nine. <laughs> Gen Zer. Not yeah. surprised. Makes sense. Both my both my parents are married, so. Okay. That's not the point. You want to hat? The, 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 the point is that you're <laughs> you you're ha- soft, bro. You you come from a politically correct era. Where you probably never got bullied, you never got told anything negative, you got told all this bullshit about being right and using pronouns and all this other shit, and that's how you move now, and that's why you're fucking soft. That's why when we make the jokes that we make, we shock people like you. But yeah, we're going to move on, bro.